that's what, that's what I'm eager to hear about. And I'm going to shut up for about the next uh, 55 minutes and, and let you go on, except for a few brief commercial breaks. So, Chris, okay, great. so delighted. Thank I mean, I'm, I'm, my sock's rolling up and down to have you back. <laughs> oh, I'm, I'm really, stop. I'm really uh, glad you're making about me it. blush. Making me blush. Uh, so, well, you and I met uh, on the September 11th many, many years ago. And I, you know, it's funny, there's a picture floating around of you and I. Um, you know, now, fast forward to now, you look older, I look great. Uh, but we, uh, that's when I started at Next Media. I was there. They're now out of business and I think they're now morphed into Alpha Media. Uh, but I left for Intercom in 2004, and I was their director of engineering for the Milwaukee and Madison stations. And I was there for 16 years, and it was a great run. I did some fantastic things there. Uh, but it got to the point where if I wanted to stay with Intercom and I wanted to you know, grow my skills and, and move up, I was going to have to leave Wisconsin. You work well on both. Yeah, mm -hmm. especially when we're talking about the industry standards anyway. Again, they're, they're standards for a reason. That's yeah, right. yeah, yeah, absolutely. That's, that's why they tend to come to the fore because, you know, if a recording studio only has to buy two or three mics versus six or seven, that makes perfect sense. Um, mm -hmm. So Chris Sharps, who is our administrator on the Facebook group, he asks, the general trend in VO circles is that you have to have a Neumann TLM 103 or a Sennheiser 416. There are many models that sound amazing and not at those price points. So what mid-range mics would you recommend? I mentioned earlier the MK4. Mm. I think it sounds great. Yeah. I, I don't know exactly what mid-range means, but uh, I'm a big fan of the Mojave Audio MA201. How much is that? That's about 700 or so. Okay. Um, yeah. That's probably upper mid-range. It, uh, probably. Um, it's a really, really great mic that, frankly, I've, I've got a TLM 103 sitting here. I like the Mojave better. I just bought the Neumann because it's got the Neumann badge on it. Right. Um, <laughs> and and I, I know I'm not the only person who's done that, but uh, I, I think it's a really, really solid performer. Uh, on the other end of the spectrum, the Mike Tech MK300 is uh, it, it's quite a head turner, and it's uh, 299 I believe. Oh, wow. Yeah. Cool. Yeah, just a terrible logo. Uh, <laughs> yes, I, I can't argue that. <laughs> yeah, I do like the Sennheiser MK4. 